Hi, I'm Claire and I'm part of the sales team here at Donaymot Leisure Kingdom um, on a very windy but fresh day. Yeah. Um, I'd like to show you around the latest motorhome that we're getting to put on the sales pitch and it is an Eldis CV60. It's a prestige. So we'll take a closer look around the outside. It's on a Fiat Ducato 2.3. It's a 140 brake horsepower. It's got the standard Fiat alloys. It's got an onboard gas tank. This is where you fill it. Here is your toilet cassette. And beneath there is the emptying points for the fresh water and the wastewater. This is where you fill the water. It has an external three pin socket. And also this is the point where we connect the mains. As we go around to the back of the vehicle, it's got a bike rack fitted. If you look up, you can see that it's got a reversing camera and also reversing sensors. It's got the wind out canopy fitted to it already. And above the door is a nice long awning light. It's diesel and it's also got ad blue. So let's take a look inside before Wendy blows away. On entering the motorhome, you can see we've got a fly screen and there is electric step. You go first, Wendy. So to the front of the vehicle, you can see this on a manual six speed gearbox. It's got a built in sat nav. This is where the reversing camera shows as well. It's got cab aircon, USB, 12 volt, speed control and speed restrictor and the expected controls on the steering wheel for answering the phone and turning the volume up and down. Yeah. Both of the seats are captain seats and behind the driver you can see where the occasional table is stored. It's had the microwave fitted here. Beneath here is a really good work surface space and also another USB point and a three pin socket. A nice little storage area there as well and as we turn around we can see we have the sink storage beneath and gas isolation taps are down the very bottom work surface extension and at the end of these levers there's little catches that you click to put it down with storage drawers and another three pin socket we have an electric ring and two gas burners with a combi oven and grill and again we've got storage below there yeah so here I jump this we have you? got the toilet and the shower room it's a wet room system with a curtain that goes all the way around to prevent everything getting wet the blue button there is the flush for the toilet we have storage i can't open it <laughs> Oh, there it is. There we go. We do have a storage. <laughs> it's a bit further along. <laughs> in there as well for all your bits and pieces. And the shower comes out of the tap and attaches up there like so. As we move down, you can see that the motor has got the day bed and it also pulls out to become a fixed bed. I'm going to get stuck with the carpet. So it pulls out yeah. and makes the French bed. It is. It's the upgraded mattress as well. We also have here a dressing table, a TV mount and plenty of storage. The motor mo motorhome has a solar panel fitted on the roof. The control for that is in here look. It's also got the TV area fitted as well. The fridge works on gas it doesn't it works just on battery do it's excuse fine. me it's fine oh, wait. and as you can see in there you've got the freezer compartment as well below here the previous owner has put shelves into the wardrobe space which makes quite a useful um probably can get more clothes in there than what you could if you were hanging them to be fair yeah, sure. but that's option to whether you'd want to take that out or not so if you'd like to come and take a closer look 
at our eldest CV60 2021, give us a call, make an appointment. My name's Claire, so you can always ask for me and we can have a close look around it together. Look forward to seeing you on site.